Hello guys, this is DH01 here on Jimmy Master Mechanics along with Green Science Boy. And today we're going to be looking at the Techie Design Sitting Scarecrow Animatronic. Now this is an item that I actually purchased at Spear Halloween uh, two or three years ago. And it was one of the last animatronics in the store and it was actually 75% off. And I believe this is a first year model, but they still make these. You can find them pretty easily. Um, so this item, what it basically does is there is a motion sensor in the bowl. There's also a sound sensor. And basically, you, you can choose to just have motion sensor or both, actually. So with this item, you have candy in the bowl, and then you reach in, and it triggers the motion sensor right there. And then his head pops up very fast. And he has this audio that's like, it actually kind of peaks out when it was recorded. So it kind of like rattles the speaker a little. It's kind of ear piercing. So it really scares you and catches you off guard. Um, but he's got a nice hat here. The arms are kind of limp. You can just put them like, if you want them to look kind of like he's dead or something, you can just have them hang. Or you can just kind of plop them on his lap and it's like he's just sitting there. He actually has something that's rare in m most modern items. He has like solid shoes. They're kind of a lightweight plastic, but they're not the kind where if you step on them, they just crack, which we've been seeing a lot lately. Um, and I'll just go over to the control area over here. So the, the only thing you need to do to set up this thing is you just put this one pole in here, and then you, can, you take a flathead screwdriver and stick in that hole to take it out, because it's a lock-into-place uh, design. But so it can take four AA batteries, or it can run off a 6-volt 2-amp BC adapter, which I have plenty of those, but I'm just using the batteries right now. Uh, it has volume control, as you can see. It's turned up pretty much all the way. There's an external speaker jack, which is really cool. Um, if I had an external speaker laying around down here, I'd plug it in, but uh, basically it, it just makes it really loud and full of bass instead of the traditional little speaker you'll see in there. And there's a uh, foot pad jack as well. And what the store displays would do is they'd have a candy insert with a chimey button, but the chimey button wasn't actually hooked up to anything. You, you would reach to press it, and it would press it, and it would set off the motion sensor right there. So pretty clever. And I do have one of those inserts, actually. Um, so yeah, there's not too much to it back here. Um, I'll show you the face when it popped up more, but he just has these two eyes. Some of the newer ones, which so will be more more easy to find. Um, there's like some black paint kind of running down here to where it looks like he's crying, and it's really creepy. But this is an older one, so he just has the you know solid looking eyes. And I'll quickly go over the box. And I apologize for the mess. My house is completely getting redone in the downstairs. Yeah, so it says sitting scarecrow. Who dares to take candy from scarecrow's bowl? Scarecrow's head snaps up, revealing a scary face. Bone showing screaming and creepy laughter. Motion sound or step pad activated. And you can use the external speakers. So there he is. You would traditionally put him in a chair, put the candy in. He is on a box right now. Um, there's the back of it. And this one was $149.99 at Spirit Halloween. And I believe, I, I did see him at the Halloween and Party Expo. So he will be, you know, sold to other customers, but primarily this was a Spirit Halloween item. And they also made other characters like these. You know, they have a witch and then they had a clown. So you can get the same effect, but you know, it just depends on what kind of character you like. So without further ado, I will switch him on to motion. So as you can see, there's on which has both sensors and just the motion sensor. So let's do that. And then we just have to reach in the bowl. <laughs> like to hit him a couple more times. You know, what he was saying about the shoes is that Techie has always been really good with like feet and shoes being like a good solid material. I just kind of wanted to make that note. Yes, and you know, typical shoes nowadays don't look like that or this. They're the thin plastic ones that have actually cracked in the box before. 
We'll activate them a couple more times, so you can just do that. I've actually not used this guy in over a year, and he still works pretty well. And yeah, the, the bowl velcros and plugs in in his crotch area. And then, I guess the velcro won't fall off or anything. Um, I don't have it on the vest right now. So that's, and it's also hanging over the edge of the box. That's why it's like that. But normally it's pretty level. You want to say anything else about this item? Uh, this is probably like the first uh, one of the items of this kind that they made. Uh, and then they also obviously made like the witch and the, the clown. Mm -hmm. But this is the original, and you know, I guess I, I was looking at the sneak peek. This has actually been made for four years now, so it's been running a long time, and we're, we're getting old. Yeah, so you can definitely find one of these pretty easy. Um, if you don't have one yet, they will probably be making more of these. So okay. I'll probably grab a find last some. Chance. But yeah, anyways, guys, that is the Sitting Scarecrow by Techie Design. Thanks for watching.